Hello everyone and good morning. I have a nice Dollar Tree haul for you today. Now this haul is very well mixed. I have some items from Crafter Square. I have wreath supplies. I have a few more brand new Easter items, new florals, and several other things that I picked up throughout the store. So let's go ahead and get started. I'll start with my favorite find on this trip. And they are these fruit stems. I finally found them in my store. I was able to find three of them and this one is called a peach stem now each of them come with four pieces of fruit and i really like that i also found the orange stem the only thing is the fruit is very small that's only about an inch and a half to two inches in diameter and then i also found the lime stem now i was able to get i believe two of the lime, two of the orange, and I did grab four of the peach. So I was really happy that these finally made it to one of my stores. Dollar Tree is also bringing back some of their really nice artificial greenery. And these are just marked artificial ferns. And uh, these two are my favorite that they get. These come on a nice long stem. So this one I really do like. I usually cut off the individual uh, leaves and glue them in on my wreaths. And then I also like this one a lot. The leaves are much larger and they work good for when you wanna do fruit and you need leaves that look like they come from fruit trees. So I was really happy to see that they got this greenery in again. I did pick up several stems of both. Dollar Tree also got these in. And these are different than what they had last year. These are called wildflowers, and I really like these. Uh, I like them because they also come with a different type of greenery with them. And the blooms are really pretty, and I like that there are multiple blooms. Uh, they do pop right off if you want to use just the florals on these, but I'm really happy they got these in. They're just calling them wildflowers. I was able to find them in this really pretty yellow white, the pink, and blue. So sometimes it's really hard to find really nice small blooms, but I think these will completely fit that bill. They're nicely done and they come with some beautiful greenery. Now I was kind of surprised when I went into one of my local stores that they got in some really cute new little ornaments for the Easter trees. And I have not seen these before. These are brand new. So I found this one, which uh, looks like little gnomes. And they're only printed on there. There's no fur or anything. That is just a printed image. So I found this one. You get four. I think this one's absolutely adorable. The little chicks popping out of an egg. And they had these really cute little bunnies, pink and blue. And then the last one I found was this really cute Easter eggs. Now on the eggs, I believe they did have a couple different patterns to choose from, but I liked these that were a little bit more on the pink side. But how nice, these would look really pretty on a wreath as well as on one of the little Easter trees. I was also able to find one box of the Peeps lights. Now I've been looking for this for a while, so I'm really happy that I found them. You get a yellow, pink and blue little peeps and I think that's so cute you get 10 per string so I thought that would be fun to use in an Easter project now these were a really nice surprise I have not seen anyone haul these yet and these are small little wooden ornaments and you get 12 pieces and it comes in this really nice little box that you can always craft with and this one has the little Easter trucks They have different color tones and they have a little gnome back there driving the truck. I thought that was so cute and I love the colors. And then I also found this one with these adorable little gnomes. And again, you get 12 pieces. 
I also grabbed one of these cute little tinsel uh, gnomes. I picked one up for St. Patrick's Day, but unfortunately I wasn't able to get to it, so I'm hoping to do one now for Easter, so I grabbed one of him. Uh, the only thing that I'm going to be keeping is his beard and his nose. So if you want to follow along with me, you just want to pick up one that has a nice beard and nose. The rest we are going to change out. Dollar Tree also had the Easter version of Oliver's uh, pretzel rods that have been dipped. This one is in white chocolate. And I like these. I think these are really good, especially if you like that kind of sweet, salty flavor. Now, I didn't find any in the regular milk chocolate. I only found them in the white chocolate this time. I did pick up a couple. This was a really nice find over in the Crafter Square section. Dollar Tree got in some fat quarters of this really pretty burlap. And these are 18 inches by 21 inches. And these are the ones that I found. I found this one with the red and blue stars on it. And then I found the one with the little ladybugs. Now they had two fresh boxes out and neither one of them had the bees. So that must have come in a different box. But I was able to find the ladybug. And then I like this one with the red and burlap color check. Some really pretty little pink and white polka dots. And then this really pretty striped with the black, jute, and white. So I was really happy I did pack, pick up two packages of each of these. I was able to find this really nice set of stencils. This is 8 inches by 18 inches. And I have been looking for this. I saw someone else haul this. And these letters are nice and large. And that is why I wanted this stencil. Yeah, so the letters are about two inches by about an inch and a half, which is good size. Most of the stencils with the lettering that you can pick up from Dollar Tree, they're all quite small. So I was really happy to see this. And then it also has some other items down here, uh, some shells, a seahorse, and some other by the sea items. So I thought that was a really nice find. You can find this in your Crafter Square section right now. I also found some really pretty pop-up stickers, and I really like these with the roses. Lots of different types of roses, and they are all three-dimensional. Some have a little bit of glitter on them. I thought those were really pretty. And then I also found this one that has all different types of carnations on it. Very, very pretty. And you get 12 pieces per pack. I also found a new rub-on transfer, and I really like this one. I love all the different bits of greenery. Very, very pretty. Now, I did pick up a couple of these because I can always use the greenery in multiple different types of crafts. If you've never used any of their rub-on transfers, I highly recommend them. They work very well, and they transfer rather easily. I was really happy that I could find these over in the office section. Uh, these are self-laminating sheets. You get three pieces. There is no machine required to use these, and they're excellent for laminating photos, business cards, recipe cards, and more. I've only seen these in Dollar Tree one other time, so I did grab three packages because this is something that you can't always find at Dollar Tree. I've been trying to get a little bit more organized in my craft room and I needed some uh, labels so that I can start marking my containers. So I picked up this package and you get 15 labels. Now I found this series of really adorable little notebooks and these almost feel like they're made with leather but they're not. Uh, I do like that they are a little bit three dimensional and that the images are stitched on top. So we have this cute little koala, and you just have blank lines inside. But I thought that was really cute, so I found the little koala. And then I found the cute little kitty. And I found an adorable little llama. They also had a few other ones that I didn't pick up. They had one that had a shark on it, and another one that had a dinosaur on it. These would be perfect as an addition to an Easter basket. 
Now this was an unexpected find at Dollar Tree, Goli Nutrition, Super Green Gummies. Now they had two packages to choose from. This one, which was the larger one, has 60 pieces. This regularly retails for $19.99. They also had a smaller one that has 30 pieces and that one usually retails for $9.95. So this is an excellent deal for Dollar Tree. If you see these, you wanna grab them, but make sure to check and see if they have the large size. So, Goalie Nutrition Super Greens Gummies. They are gluten-free, non-GMO, gelatin-free, and vegan. Now this is a repurchase for me. This is a facial wash. This is by Skin Nutrition Botanicals. It is tea tree oil and it has salicylic acid. I don't know if I pronounced that right, probably not. But that is a nice light exfoliator. It helps to remove any dead skin and keeps your skin nice and glowy. So this is a really nice product. I do recommend it. And you can find it in the skincare section at Dollar Tree. Now this was something new that I found on the shelf. I really love Freeman. If you've been watching me, you know I love their products. And six fluid ounces is a full size. But this is the first time I've seen the Japanese matcha cream mask. It is detoxifying. And I was really excited to see this. I wanted to try it. It's supposed to be really good at removing impurities out of your skin. So I'm going to give this a try. I've been very happy with all of the other masks made by Freeman that I've purchased. Now this was something that I haven't seen before at Dollar Tree and this is a dry mouth gel. It is by Lucky Super Soft. It helps protect delicate oral tissues long lasting comfort. Uh, I do tend to have an issue with dry mouth every once in a while. Some of the medications that I take tend to do that to me. So I was really happy to see this. I'm going to give it the good old college try and see if it works for me. I also found some more Kiss Nails and these are the long length. I really do like the color on them. They're very neutral, just kind of that soft color. and. You get 24 nails. Usually I can get two sets out of a package that has 24 or more. And even though these are the long length, which are a little longer than what I like, because they are a solid color, I can always trim these a little shorter so that they're a little bit more suited to the length that I like. But I love Kiss Nails. They are a good quality, nice find for Dollar Tree. This was also something new that I found in the beauty section, Precision Facial Razor, and you get two pieces, and it folds up nicely like this, or the end, other end flips open that has the blade, and I figured this would be good to, um, you know, remove any of those little unwanted uh, peach fuzz that I get above my lip or maybe on my cheeks. So I decided to pick up a package and give it a try. If you've used this, let me know in the comments below if you like it or not. Now I was able to find several more products by this brand, Le Mercige. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it or not, but I really like all of the products that I found. So this is a nude, smoky, shimmery eyeshadow with applicator. You get four different shades. I thought that was really nice. The total net weight is 0.11 ounce. I also found some black mascara. Now I did pick up two of those because I use mascara the most. And this is their volumizing mascara and you get 0.07 fluid ounces. And then I also found a black long lasting eyeliner. So I'm really excited to try these out. This is pretty much exactly what I wear when I wear makeup. So I'm excited to see how well this works. Now I have picked up in the past some of the foundation and also a setting spray. So now that I have pretty much all of everything I need, I'm excited to give it a try and see how my skin reacts. Now this was an interesting find. This is by Cody and I used to use this brand all the time when I was younger. This is Loose Face Highlighter and I do like their products. My skin tends to like them. It doesn't break out. They don't get cakey. 
So I was excited to see this. I picked one up to try. And this was also a nice find. This is Shadow Switching Sponge. This sponge is a cleaning tool that easily removes color from eyeshadow brushes so that they can be used to apply a new color. So I thought that was fun. I haven't seen this before at Dollar Tree, so I decided to pick one up. Let me open it up for you. Okay, that's nice. That's a very textured sponge, so that should work really well to remove any excess shadow. And this is made by Sassy and Chic. I also grabbed another brow pencil by LA Colors. Now I use their brow pencils I have for several years and I really do like it. It's actually one of the only ones that I can find that has the right color. And this is a dark blonde. Now these I had to just grab because the packaging is so adorable. And these are Mini Ice Pops Lip Gloss by B Color. And this one is in Grape. And this one is in Watermelon. I thought they would be perfect. Something fun to keep in my purse during the summer to keep my lips nice and moist. I also discovered that they had the Kiss Glue for your nails. And so I did pick up a package. This is a super bonding glue and it sets in seconds. And it's perfect for repairs or adding artificial nails. I also picked this up, which is by Be Pure. This is a lavender cuticle oil pin. And since I do my nails all the time, I'm always having to uh, give my cuticles a little extra love. So I thought this would definitely come in handy. This is a brand new item that I found over in the car care section. This is a refresher car. It is an odor eliminator. This is an activated charcoal pouch that you can hang anywhere and it does help absorb odors. There is no fragrance to it, so it's not going to put fruity or um, anything like that in the air. It simply absorbs the odor. And then once you feel like it's not working too well anymore, you can put it outside in the sun, let it sit in the sun for about 15 to 30 minutes, and that will help to recharge your charcoal so that it can work again. But I thought this would be great not only to put in my car, I'm going to hang one next to my cat boxes and anywhere else where I find I have odor in the house. So I was really excited to find these. I did pick up several. I did grab some more wreath supplies. I was uh, out of my eight inch wreath forms. So I picked up a couple more packages and I really like that you still get two per package. I also picked up some more of my favorite mesh that Dollar Tree carries. And this is the decorative mesh that has the snow on it. That's what I call it. And I like this. This is a little bit more sheer. It has the feeling of tulle, but with the snow on it, it gives it a lot more texture. And I like it because you can do cut methods and it does not fray at all. So I picked up a couple in the pink, a couple in the lavender, a couple more in this beautiful blue, and a couple more in the spring green. Very nice. I also picked up some of their pink burlap ribbon. Now you can find this in the Easter section and this is two and a half inches at nine feet. Whenever they have a solid color burlap ribbon in the seasonal decor, I always pick up a couple extra packages because this can be used throughout the year for any season or holiday. I also found some more of the lace ribbon. This is 1.12 inches at 3.28 feet and I did grab two more rolls. I am so happy that they're starting to carry a wider lace ribbon. They also put out another box of their spring ribbon and this is the smaller ribbon. This is 5 eighths of an inch. You get 12 feet. So these were the three that I chose. I really like this one. It has those really pretty little yellow roses on it with some little, it looks like purple pansies and then this one ha just says home and has that little bit of greenery and then this one has that sage background with the little leaves rolling down the center which I thought was very pretty they would all look great on a spring craft
I also picked up several more boxes of the tissue and this is the puffs. Uh, we were going through a box a day when we were both sick so we went through everything I had. I needed to restock for our next round so I did pick up a couple boxes and I'm really glad that this is the Puffs brand because these are a little softer than the other ones that they normally carry. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed today's Dollar Tree haul. If you like hauls and craft tutorials, you'll want to check out these videos. Thanks so much for stopping by. It's always a pleasure to see you. You have a great day and I'll catch you in the next video.